The story so far, Aaliyah and her robot Six are looking for the missing roboticist Janaki Remba. The trail has led them to a ruin hidden inside the center of a dangerous river vortex known as the Cyclones. But what was Remba doing here? And why did he want Miari to follow him? And where is Renba? Is he dead? Hey folks, welcome back to uh, Afterwork Gaming. We are back for more Heaven's Vault, and I've been looking forward to this. Now, um, we are in the heart of the Cyclones, or the Eye of the Cyclones, rather. Uh, and what? there's some kind of building here. I found a real treasure, a crown, perhaps even the Crown of Iox. Remba found it, I think. Now there's a column of smoke here, and I think it might be from his ship. Right. And then last time we also uh, translated some new words, and there were a bunch of ones that we just couldn't translate because they have phrases that I, or uh, symbols that I have never seen. But, found an ancient crown found carved in a swirling scratch. This, uh, the one? I, no. There's the one, I, I want to correct the one that we have. Found a dented silver container, no. Found carved above the hearth, no. Off a lid, found an ancient crown, dagger. Scratched on a wall. Translate. I fear death. Now, in the comments, and I think at least one person agreed with me, I don't think this is death. I think this is stranger. Um... It's like someone we don't know, basically. And why? Well, because... Here's, here's my thought. This was in the, on the wall up, up above a bed where someone was lying, and there's another bed in the house by the hearth, which suggests to me that there are... Or by the hearth, rather. There are two people in this house, and one is afraid of the other, which would make sense if one of them has, you know, daggers and crowns and whatnot. Okay, so let's just start looking around. Never known a sky so empty. I've never been this far from the rivers before. Okay. Uh, let's see what else. Garden beds. Garden beds. Something must have been able to grow here once. Though I can't see how. Well, you do have, you know, the statue inside which resembles the whole, um, water goddess, etc. At least inscription and mindset. And you can see this is either a remnant of bushes, or these are sticks to guide, like, vining plants. Okay. Wanna look at this? No, there's something back there, though, that's growing. Hmm, bone dry. Okay. Could it, po could it be possible that the ecosystem got affected by the fact that we're in the eye of the cyclones? Kind of marker? Yeah, yeah, we'll look at that in a second. Something hanging. Ancient wood. Ancient wood. Sticks are all but petrified. Can't even rot out here. But there's something cut into it. Oh, hello. This one is a phrase run together. And oh man. Um, keep. Oh, I see. I wonder... Okay, I can't add my translation for keep to my dictionary now. Sweet! Okay, I wonder... Before we got the actual word, whether we can actually miscut the, the, the phrase, you know, like if this is some symbol, and then this symbol plus the one for keep is a different word, you know what I mean? But, okay. So this is an X which we thought uh, might mean no. And this is like a person or a description of a person, right? So this is a me, and we know that's the right translation. So me dot, person dot is me. What if it's you, right? Person, but like a little swish going like to somebody else. So you, keep you. Harvest, garden, death, gate. Hmm. Stranger. Keep. It's not... no. See, if this was death... Huh. Death keep you? No, garden keep you, because it is in a garden plot. And it's... It, it may be a marker for a grave, is what I'm saying, right? So... 
garden. Nah, no. Like, this is clearly a piece of this. Where was this? I fear stranger. Now, what was my thinking when I picked that translation? Yeah, I know. I fear stranger, right? We just talked about this. We don't know what this word means. Last stranger. It's clearly about a person. I don't like that it's... These are the same here, right? Add op and open declare. No. Because it's this piece that we're worried about, or I'm worried about. I fear the goddess. No. I fear death. No. Now, the reason I thought it was death is... But it's like this unknown. Right? Dot unknown. Maybe? Okay. Go back here. Fear lights... Now, to work out the other words... Yeah, 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 I hear you. Keep you. Death keep you. Fear. Fear, 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 fear. Okay, well, let's... Darn, this is kind of a... This is kind of a tough... This is like a blind guess right now. Let's put garden keep you for the moment. Right? Because it is in a garden plot. But I... Really think it's wrong. Okay. Garden keep you. That will do for now. Yeah, it will. But what is this? Not a statue, not a device, not a weather vane or moisture catcher. A grave. A grave? The shape, the position away from the beds, sheltered. I wonder if whoever dug that grave believed in the loop like they do on Iox. The lupus say that to be reborn, a soul must return to the rivers. Burying someone prevents them from coming back. It's the worst thing you can do to your enemies. So it could be death. If that's the case, if that's the case, if this is a lupus, it could be death. Meaning, you know, let death keep you, i.e. may you stay dead. But then why make a marker, right? Something here, a necklace. Seashells. What are these things? Flat beads. Ceramic? I'm not sure. Oh, it has nothing written on it, huh? Okay. So... Yeah, we're gonna come back to that word. I... That's not sitting right with me. Now I'm starting to doubt the stranger thing. Oh, hey, Six. So, who is buried outside, then? Whoever owned the place first, perhaps? Before it was taken from them? But then why lovingly make a marker for it? You know what I mean? There's nowhere to go. Or anything back here, maybe thrown out a window? Nope. Okay, let's go back inside. Ooh, hold on. So two people died here. One upstairs, who was buried outside, and then later another by the fire below, right? Because the remains are right on the mattress, basically. Coming back, Six. You found a grave, mistress. How did you know? You insist on talking to yourself. <laughs> I assume it has been some time since your last robot. Okay. While we do that, so there's the door. Now, how do we get to the other parts of this little area? Wait, hold on. Is there something on the table? No, it was just wheat. I climb out the window? No. Okay, this is the map. I kind of have a description for that. Look, a little gecko. Hey there, buddy. No, 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 no. I was looking at a gecko. Thank you very much. Ooh, maybe we can... No. Oh, Alright. Maybe we can climb over that tree in the back? Okay. Uh, okay, let's go back in here then. Now, before we go upstairs, let's go down here again. This is where Six came out of last time. Because he drove around and basically dropped down outside. This is a comfortable space. Wide. Open. 
Old mistress. I hear you. After the dead air of the house, it was good to see the sky again. You have collected three interesting artifacts here. Also, we have located our new location of interest, the site from the mural. I suggest we take the crown to Professor Miari directly. We must also inform her of the theories about Remba. If you wish me to activate the hopper now, mistress, would that be acceptable? No, we've still... looking around. Okay, there must be more to this place. I want to know who lived here, who died here, and what happened to Renba. So a hopper is a teleporter? A short distance teleporter, mistress. No way through here, though it would have once been open enough. But what is a hopper? I mean, what's inside it? An interconnected mesh of quantium. The quantium creates some kind of field, which the subject is passed through and di dissected via... Uh, mistress, does it matter? Ooh, hello. A carving. There's something carved above the door. Okay. Okay, that one is light. This is the end of a longer line of text. Okay, well, this is clearly light. From... Oh, that's one word, huh? I believe you are correct with from, mistress. Yes! Man, we are just hitting it out of the park. Here we go. Which leaves one word to guess. Light from... So what I think, what I think is... This is the time, right? Time of a place. Which light from... From night? No. From birth? No. From here? No. It's gotta be a time. Night From night, maybe. Light from night. Doesn't make any sense, but we do only have a piece of it. Light from night? I think that's correct. Yeah, I don't know if it is. Okay. There is another, there is another garden bed over here. There's an inscription on the window, too? Wow, cool. Whoa. Shuttered window. I've not encountered any of these words elf anywhere else, but I can still make some guesses. From. Or. Okay, so this is not from. So it's really to, or... Okay, so from goddess. Well, we're, I'm pretty certain about god and goddess. This is blesses. And blessings. Oh, let's thanks, gratitudes. No, let's go with blessings. We need blessings. Or goddess. Horses. We. Uh, do, 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 do. Not a stranger of. Follow? Hmm. What if it's sanctifying, right? We give. Shout, need, want. We give. We give blessings for the goddess. We give blessings for the goddess. Eh, maybe. We does we give blessings for goddess make sense? But what is this place? A mansion too small for barracks. Any idea, Six? It's not a mansion. I think it's probably a halfway home. Any idea, Six? All right, thanks, Six. You're you're really helpful there. Now hold on. There was a channel we could look at. This channel natural? I don't think it is. Dug out. There must be a wellspring here. A feeble one. One that requires every drop to be used. Oh, it's just six talking. Water would have run down the channel right past the house. Imagine having a stream of your own. Not a bad way to live. If you can withstand the soul-crushing loneliness. Someone lived out here. They irrigated the land, prayed, here, in the eye of the cyclones. Some kind of hermit? 
script there's an inscription on the rock too man there's something carved on there's something carved on everything around here is what you're saying this one is a fractured fragment from an even longer phrase yeah so this clearly this is water um that's the word for water short and simple and almost a pictogram yes it is I'm also sure of us and you guys this is we are just building that dictionary. There's only one word left to resolve. Water separates us. Water joins us. Water heals. Joins. Right? Because maybe this is what... If this is potentially welcome, then... The problem is, I, this is clearly... Like, these are starts and stops. Like, this is, a, this is the beginning of a verb. This is the beginning of a noun, I think. I don't know what that is. But it's not separates. There's no X, which would have been the negative in the sort of a negative word, maybe. Some water connects us. Water joins us. Mm, the shrine was built here. Is the stone inside from Myerzy? No, mistress. I do not know where it is from, but Myerzy does not have stones like this. Hmm. Okay, hold on. Let's look at that shrine. That's the shrine. Assuming it's not an outhouse. It's not an outhouse. If we can find where the shrine came from, maybe we can work out whose crown we found. How do we get to the shrine? It looks like we can go around. There's another inscription. You could see it from there. This one in several words. Yes, yes it is. So the Emperor... Forever. Oh, look at that, look at that, look at that, we have that symbol now. I'm convinced my translation for forever is right. Hmm. Home. Garden. Emperors live forever. Sleep forever, watch forever. Live. I'm almost positive this is a life. You know, uh, if, the, if, if we're talking about, right? A building in which we live, live. Emperors live forever. Emperors? Here? What are emperors doing out here? You have the crown, Aaliyah. You have the crown. According to legend, the last emperor disappeared after Iox fell. He didn't die uh, there with everyone else. Are you suggesting he came here? Why not? It would explain a few things. Not exactly that crown, and not least that crown. But the last emperor killed the hermit who lived here, then the emperor buried them in the dirt. We only know that the emperor outlived them. We do not know there was a murder. Fair point. The emperors of Ajax were all devout believers in the loop. To bury someone outside instead of returning them to the rivers to be reborn. That's what you do to your worst enemy. If the Emperor was hiding here, perhaps he did not want anyone returning to find him. Well then, oh my god, then the inscription is Death Keep You. Hold on, sorry. Let's just go there here real quick. Right channel, shuttered window, lintel, wood marker, here we are. No, 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 hold on, stop. It's not, I want this one, yes. Garden Keep You, no. Because non-life keep you. Boom. Exit. Okay. That's better. So non-life keep you. All this speculation is fascinating, mistress. But are we not losing sight of the wreckage of Master Renba's ship? If that is indeed what you saw. You know what an archaeologist is, don't you? The speculation is my job. Finding lost Ioxians is not... Oh, is not. So why did the last emperor draw a map to the site from the mural? Wishing for some kind of peace as he lay dying? The emperor is believed in the loop, mistress. But to be reborn, you must be burned. Unlike all those before him, the last emperor faced true death. Interesting. Perhaps the emperor drew the map to tell his soul where to go. Okay, there's also a passageway over there, so let's go check out this place. Yeah, here we go. A stone pedestal. With someone in it. It's from Kibenya from Mayor. It's Kibenya from Mayor. It's a local goddess, poor quality work. 
That does look like Kibenya. It's Kibenya from Myersi. The site was linked to Myersi then. That's somehow how Remba found it. It's the goddess from Myersi, isn't it? Mistress, you can recognize her by her hat. <laughs> That's not a hat, Six. It's an aura. You are correct, Mistress. It is not a hat. It is most technically a fascinator. Okay, fine. Uh, the shrine is made of the stone. The shrine is made of stone. But it's not the same stone as the moon itself. Is it as old as the building? The outer structure is, certainly. But the stone pillar, no. The building here are significantly older than the pillars. I'm going to say that the pillar was. Presumably it's made from local stone, though. Yeah. Brought by a later occupant, then? Whoever it was who buried the original occupant, maybe. Moving it to the mo to this moon must have been difficult. Treasure possession, important ritual object. Uh, an important ritual object? It is significantly more valuable than the goddess we found within. Huh. Well, speaking of the goddess... Simply fashioned companion herself must be worth something. Simply fashioned... Not a treasure, a functional item. This should tell us a little more about this place. And there's an inscription. Perfect. It's impossibly small. Whoa, there is a new symbol. This is one end of a broken fragment of text. Hmm. Small clay figurine. Cool. I don't know what that is. And this almost makes it seem like this should be part of a larger word. You know what I mean? See? You can miscut these words. Huh. Okay. Sacred. Something's gone wrong. I must have used the wrong words. Yeah, see? This is what I was thinking. Okay, so... Okay. This and goddess. Nice. Can I add my translation for goddess to my dictionary now? It's a long one, but I think it must say bless. Nice. And now we just have this. Man. But I've not seen anything even close to this last word. Yeah, you're right. Goddess, bless. I mean, it, it could very well be plants or flowers. Which also makes sense for why it wouldn't be garden in the marker. Flower, plants, harvests. Not, well, plant. Harvest, but uh, harvest would be longer. Harvest would be like, to take of plants or something, right? But it is Kibenya, so she is the goddess of fertility and water. So goddess bless the plants. Goddess bless plants. No, I mean, it's probably wrong, but okay, fine. Now we have two ways to go. Let's actually see if we can keep moving up that way, this little path. And if not, we'll check out that little side entrance. Man, guys, I love this game. <laughs> I love this translation. Okay, so that's where the wreckage is. Let's not go to the wreckage yet. Let's go to this little side door. Um, yeah, I love the translation. I love the exploration. I love the fact that it's... I would estimate the building is at least 700 years old. Yeah, how do you work that out? I have been observing the rate of withering on the stones. Extrapolating, this building is older than the founding of the Holy Empire of Iox. Really? You know, Six, back on Iox, they say nothing is older than the Empire. That the Empire and the Fall are all that has ever been. My apologies, Mistress. I did not wish to offend. I mean, instead, that this building is older than anything on Iox. By several hundred... Well, several hundreds of years. You're not offending me. It'll be dark in there. Renba? Hmm. Nothing. Wait. Are you not going in there because it's going to be dark? <sighs> I need a light. Fine. Let's go see if we can find a light in the wreckage. If Iox does not believe in history... What is it they think you do? 
<laughs> waste my time. Iox believes in the loop. They believe what has happened will happen again. They think I'm out discovering the future. Whoops. By all the moons and waters. It's a ship. I mean... It was a ship. Huh. Can we be sure this was Janaki's ship? No, mistress. But the circumstantial evidence is very strong. Someone blasted from the sky? Really, mistress. That seems speculative, to say the least. What could do that? Eagles are supposed to breathe fire, aren't they? There are no eagles, mistress, as you well know. I would calculate it exploded on attempting to rise from the surface. The mangled pieces rained down at very high velocity, ricocheted and buried themselves in the dust. In short, I'm surprised there's anything left. Janaki? Most likely not. Wow, you are really, really happy about that, huh? Remba didn't hop her down. He landed his boat. Tried to. Or else he wasn't able to return. There are traces of an explosive propellant, mistress. I suspect Master Remba attempted to detonate himself off the surface of the moon. Really? I wonder why Remba didn't use a hopper to get down here. Landing his ship must have been almost impossible. Was he a devout believer in the loop, perhaps? The loop is oh, the loop is believed that hoppering is like throwing oneself into a river. It is intended for the dead. It removes part of the soul. Oh, is that six explaining it? Man. Remba lost more than part of his soul down here. Indeed, mistress. Blackened. Presumably the ship was still burning as it fell. This is the hull. So what do we do now? Uh, we tell... <laughs> return to Iox and form Professor Miari, mistress. Yeah. I suppose... I always assumed we would find Renba. I assumed... I don't know. I assume we'd find something. Not just wreckage. We have found something, mistress. But what was the pla what what this place is and why it is important... Perhaps you can take the matter up with Remba in his next life, mistress. Uh, fair point. This was the hull. Hmm. It must have been an explosion, mistress. Enough to be seen on Myersi. Janaki, and what do we tell Mayari? Huh. And Janaki? No, he's dead. We figured that one out, right? Mistress, there is no hope. Janaki must have been sailing when it fell. He cannot possibly have survived. The fire here must have been burnt up a lot of air. The remaining atmosphere is thin, mistress. I still believe the fire was extinguished before it consumed the whole ship. What I can't figure out is this. What was Remba doing finding ancient sites? He must have been following some kind of trail, mistress. But how that trail began and where it was leading him... Most unclear. <laughs> Were you hiding, Renba? A good question, mistress. But he cannot hear you. Yeah, fair enough. Okay, so there's a bunch of interesting points here to look at. Is there a way down? There might be more clues down there. I do not believe it would be wise, mistress. Indeed, I believe it would be quite the opposite. And there was a tripod up on the roof. Empty now. It looks like it might have held something once. What kind of something? I would guess... I mean, theoretically, it's a telescope. A telescope? This must have been some kind of outpost observatory. An interesting theory, mistress, but I cannot imagine why they wanted to observe. Or what they wanted to observe, rather. There's something under... wedged under here. Seems to have survived the fire. Please, please, don't be an arm. It's not an arm. A scratched silver compass. I think it dates from the early Empire? This must have been aboard Janaki's ship. 
another of his finds. Is this what he took from the stand on the roof uh, on the roof up there? But no, it's not from this moon. An heirloom, maybe? It has that look to it. Something that was old even when it was used. The casing would seem to be inscribed with glyphs, mistress. Oh, a whole piece of glyphs. This is fractured. Yes, yes it is. Not. On. Can I add my translation for on to my dictionary now? I can certainly add path. Okay. Hey, okay, there's follow, there's from, there's pilgrim on path. Stay on path. Don't follow path. Don't fly. Nope. Move. Go on the path. Stay on the path. Life on the path. There's no life. There's no symbol for life. We know that. Shall walk. Shall move. People moving to a building, for, for, to a temple, right? Maybe? So don't... Ah, uh, okay. Follow. It's either stay or fly, I bet. So let's say stay on the path for now. Does stay on path work? Most likely, this comes from the same place as the chipped coin and the statuette shard we found before. It should help us at work out where to look for an unknown moon. Interesting. I'm also still looking for a flashlight of some kind. Must have been burned for days. I'm not gonna curse the dead over here. What do we tell Miyari? The truth, surely, mistress. Janaki is gone. Maybe he wanted us to... Maybe he wanted us to think he's gone. You think about that, Six? Maybe he blew up his own ship and then went away somehow? Somewhere? Maybe he's just faking his death so that nobody... Well, though, he wanted... No, he wanted me already to follow him. I can barely see the rivers above. And yet, there's something there. Which makes me wonder... What else is out here waiting to be found? Mistress, please. We should not linger. If anything were to go wrong out here, we would never be found. We did take all the clues, didn't we? Someone would come looking for us. We're out here looking for Janaki, aren't we? Janaki is Miari's friend. Are you? Ouch. Honestly, I have no idea. Fair point. Okay. Okay. This channel comes up from the rock. This wellspring must be down there somewhere. The spring is dead now, mistress. And you are breathing the last air this moon has to offer. Janaki is not here, mistress. Neither is anyone else. Are you ready to go yet? Soon. Not yet. I'm gonna find out what else we can find here. Anything else here? It's bothering me that I can't go into that cave, by the way. Just throwing this out there. Scan up here. Nope, there's nothing. Hmm, Bremen must have really wanted to hide what he hid in that box of his. I wonder why. Because it's the crown of Iox. It's kind of important. Hey, there's a box. No? Oh, that's just a piece of decorative wood. Hmm. Is there anything else for us to find? So, I like crystals from the site of Remba's cache must have been mined during the Empire period to make things like the brooch Remba found. There might be some evidence of that work left, or some artifacts from the connected sites. Can I go to the other side? Is there something on the other side? That's my question. Hello. There is another side to this. And there wouldn't be another side to this. There wasn't at least something to be found. Right, Six? I hear you. I'm with you. Nope, there's nothing else to be found. Dang. I'm still going with Remba faked his, faked his death. Nothing we can do here, Six. Nothing at all. 
Hmm. We need a light source. And a light source to get into that cave. Nope. Thought maybe there was gonna be a light maybe something here. Goes back to the ship. No, because I don't want to leave this place. I don't know if I can come back. Six, is there I mean, can you do you not have a flashlight? Nothing? You got brushes that clean your tracks, you got no flashlight? Fine. Anything down all the way at the end here? Nope. Okay, so this is just take us back to the ship. Now, give me one second. Uh, if this takes too long, I will cut it out. I just want to see if the house has, like, I don't know, a torch or anything. Because I kind of don't want to leave that cave alone for a minute. Uh, cave alone, unless we really have nothing. Is there no inventory? Nope. Okay. <laughs> and let's actually go see the roof thing at the top as well. One more time, just to be sure. Nope, oh, come on. Okay, and we come back here. Let's take another look inside. Alright, okay. Coins and axes and such. Okay, the box, it's gone. But I don't understand why Remba would have come out here. There's nothing to find. Nothing anymore. But there was a body. We can get one of these and just light them. That'll last for a little bit. Let's, no, let's, 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 let's. Let's go see upstairs whether there's something. And then we will call it there. And then there's this room, right? That we can't get through. Maybe there's just places we can't get in. Yeah. I'm down? No, I don't think so. Chair, this is where we had the inscription of somebody lying, dying, or being afraid of someone. Okay. Right. Now we go upstairs here. Six would not be happy with me for this. No, he wouldn't, but that's not the point. Point is... Nothing else over there. There is the broken ship. Um, hey, there's nothing else. Well, nothing else is nothing else. All right, let's go. Let's go back to the ship, and we will call it there. Sorry, guys, it wasn't that long of a detour, but I just wanted to be sure. I don't like the fact that we couldn't find that cave. Although, if you have thoughts about how we could potentially. By all means, leave a comment. <laughs> um, I... I'm just a little peeved that they're really... That it seems like there's no way, and that Six is just not doing it. I think he'd do it. He's a robot. He's got things. He's got lights. Or something. Fine. We have acquired one more promising artifact here. The Scratch Compass. I am sure Wang will want to catalog it for you. Are you ready to go now, Mistress? Fine. Thanks, Six. Leave the moon. Please stand by, Mistress. I probably- I probably missed something. Darn. Darkness. This is not the Nightingale. Six? Six? This isn't the ship. It's cold in here. Are we in the cave? Oh, hello. There you are. Where's your head? Niari. Six, you're all right. You followed me, Lexi. As I thought you might, because you knew, because you've always known. Is someone calling? 
There is no one here. You are quite alone. You might confess your lie quite safely. What lie? You are not what you claim. I know this, Miari. You asked me to look and I found so much. Right? And who am I? You are just what you appear to be, and nothing more. I don't understand. Am I talking to Remba? I just, I, before I say I'm not Remba, there isn't time. I found something. Something that matters more than your lies. Lexi, there is a great darkness, an all consuming, hungry darkness, and it is coming. How are you doing this, Janaki? How are you talking to me? I'm sorry to tell you this, but... You're dead. There is an ancient place, Miari, an observatory. It is watching and it holds the wires of our fate in its claws. An observatory? I will find it before the vault is lost. The robots know, but they don't remember. Someone long ago made certain they would not remember. Hey, okay, how do I help you? Remember, how do I help you? Oh. You have my apologies, mistress. I do not understand the question. What are you talking about? It's nothing sick. Yeah. What were you talking about? Nothing, mistress. We have maintained a companionable silence for several minutes. Uh, okay, let's see if we can get out of here. Wherever here is. This way, mistress. Yeah, we're in the cave. I don't remember how we ended up in here. Operas can misfire due to imperfections, mistress. The eye aboard your ship is quite old. And no one called you just now? Evidently not, mistress. Uh, no, which... But Six, I was just talking to you. You weren't making any sense. You are making no sense now, mistress. Okay, let's just look around this place real quick. Maybe there's... Although, given hoppers require a line of sight to hopper eye, I cannot see how we ended up in this spot. Some process of refraction, no doubt. Like, take a loop around. Maybe there's something on the walls. Potentially. I mean, even rocks have inscriptions around here, so there's everything's inscribed in this place. Uh. Nope, this is just a quirk of the geometry. There's a light this way. There's a light this way. We're going to come out right next to the shrine. Just bank on that. I see where we are now. Although I still don't see how we got in there. Shall I try the hopper one more time, mistress? Um... You think it'll work properly now? I thought it would work last time. But I do not see such much alternative. Shall I use the hopper again? Yeah, let's go. Thanks, Six. I don't think that door is standby, mistress. I don't think that door is open, so let's just get back to the Nightingale. Interesting. And so we left the surface of the ruined Hermitage Moon near Myersi. With enough new evidence to find an undiscovered site. Cool. Alright. Uh, let's... Get back to the Nightingale and we'll put a pin in it. And we got a lot of new words and we got a lot of new inscriptions. And a huge mystery. Aboard the Nightingale, we should sail to Iox and tell Miari what we've seen. And I'm sure she wants to see the crown. But just look at this thing. It's heavy. Whoever wore this had a strong neck. It is more than a simple crown, mistress. You're sure? I believe the metal is a casement for a mechanism of some kind. Mech 
mechanism. A mechanism? What kind of mechanism? Without opening it up, I cannot tell. I might be able to help. Maybe Miari will be able to... Does it open? Not in any way I can see. But if it does contain a mechanism, I would expect the method by which it might be serviced. You want to make a hammer to price this artifact, my friend Aroi? Let's stay away from Miari for a second. My friend Aroi may be able to help. On Elbereth. Huh. Well, there's another place to go. We'll be able to open it up and take a look at it safely. The occupants of Elbereth are hardly trustworthy. Yeah? I'm from Elbereth. I will bear that in mind. <laughs> Shifty eyes. Let's take to the rivers, the figurine. Um, no, you know what? We'll put a pin in it here, and then we'll come back to it next time. We'll look around the cabin, and then we'll get on the rivers and figure out where to go next. Okay? Um, in the meantime... We will call it there. If you guys enjoyed it, like, comment, subscribe, tell a friend. Let me know that I'm doing something right. Let me know that you guys want to see more of this stuff. If you have thoughts about this game, you think I'm missing something, you think I might be mistranslating something, or, and I'm putting this out there, you know, we're going to get to episode 10. I'm pretty sure we're still going to be in the middle of this. Do you want to have some sort of catch up on the ancient language? Do you want to do something special? By all means, let me know in the comments. And in any case, I'll see you all next time.